Hey guys, I just wanted to go over some stuff that I do with kids out here. I do this every time my boy and I come out here to throw. We warm up with this drill. He's got good motion, but I don't want him to get away from the technique that we've taught him. And the technique that I have taught my kid is elbow needs to be at 90 degrees and when everything needs to work together. Foot plants, rotate, 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 and throw through. So it's, it's all in one motion. You see a lot of kids, they'll get on the mound and it looks good. They'll plant, they'll start their rotation, but their arm is still way back here. Well, now they've lost all the strength in their hips and their legs. Now they're just dragging it through with all arm. That causes unnecessary strain on the elbow. So this is a good tool. It's not the perfect, I know every kid's arm slot or flexibility is different. This is just a good general tool to get the kid as close as possible to throwing the right technique. So I'm gonna do this from a mound. You can actually do it on flat ground also. So you take this stick, get the arms a little at 90 degrees. So when they raise it up, both arms are at 90. So you get on the mound, you come up to 90, leg kick, and then you follow through just like you're throwing a ball. I want this hand, that's up the back hand, the throwing hand, I really want them to visualize they're throwing a ball to an object down the way. So to take this hand right here, and they're gonna throw it, throw it. But what, what this causes, since you have the lead hand on this stick, it doesn't allow the hand to drag behind, which will eliminate a lot of elbow pain. Don't want that arm dragging behind. So again, keep both hands on, and then just pull it through and it'll create really close to the perfect throwing motion, especially if they have bad technique. But again, I use this with my kid every time we come out here and throw and it really helps him to refocus on technique. So when he throws, he's uh, taking that pressure off of that elbow.